we got some South Park Furniture event for you. Not really an event. I'm kind of doing the event. It just so happens that my deck has a two point. The deck that I've been running for fun has a two point. Oh, where's my face? Has a two point. Oh, oh, uh oh, uh oh. I can't bring my face back, guys. I can't bring my face back. It's busted. Wait. Hold on. There we go. That was odd. Um, but anyway, welcome in. We're going to run a two-point deck. And are we going to finish this event with a two-point deck? Probably not. 50 games is a lot. But we're going to have some fun. We have a... Um, Six Element Randy deck, basically. We've been having some fun with it. Um, we also have a... That we might play this one a little bit too. This one's an interesting future Randy deck. This is an actual event deck. If we wanted to run it, maybe we'll pop into that to try to get like a five point win. But we're top 500 right now, so it's pretty sweaty up here. This is Matt's deck that we've been messing with. And that's a variation of it. No, this is Matt's deck. This is the one I ran with full goth kids to mess with. But anyway, let's start with this one. I appreciate you guys being here. We'll also roll through the other accounts. Either way, we got a pretty long South Park video coming your way. So hopefully we'll keep our keep our wits about us. 50 wins tonight. I don't know. It might it might be tough, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. If I can keep my if I can keep my rank from 8,300, we might be all right. All right. Let me lead the Mecca. I should probably not lead Mecca behind New Kid this week because he'll probably just get inkened or something, but that's not a big deal. You have level six hanky. Oh, so my Satan is level six, which is pretty funny. Which is pretty funny. Level 6 Satan. You don't really see that too much. Early stream? It's not too early. It's 6 p.m. Saturday, is, usually I don't stream though. So like it's early just being Saturday in general, I guess. I wouldn't have used the ability there. Kind of a waste. Bit of a waste. Do, 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 do. Oh no. Oh no. Bing. Oh nice, it was her again. That's pretty sick. Doop. Not doing the event? I mean, I'm sort of doing the event because it's a two-point deck. Damn. Guess we always gotta expect Satan. We gotta get the robot out, it's better for the health. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, an extra 1k health, baby. Oh, he's still alive. If he can get some hits off on this fryer. Ugh. One's good, one's good. Get it, Hanky. Hanky Panky. Oh, the robot's hitting new kid? Oh, robot's hitting new kid. Not bad. Not bad. New kid probably could have dealt with that, but... Didn't have enough health to test it. This is good. This is good. Bop. Come on. Hit him once. Hit him again. Oh, no way I didn't get my shield off. No way. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. That was shenanigans. Shenanigans. Shenanigans used to be my sub emote, but then we changed it. Shenanigans! Shenanigans! I should bring that back for something. Oh, I should just use that so there's less damage from them. Brutal. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Oh, I wasn't expecting that. That's BS. That's BS. Shenanaglands. Shenanigans. Benigans. 
I feel like we're gonna get it on the top side with them robots. Them robots. Oh, the robot! Yeah, that's game over. That's game over with the robot. Actually, Satan might get on New Kid. Oh, we took out the monkey. That's big. Ma. Those little robots. Those little robots. All right. Now we also have the adventure lock. See if we can switch to it. There it is. Which also has a two-point deck. Um, but we also have this fun deck with, with Thunderbird. So let's play that one first. Thunderbird, Thunderbird. Feel any better? Eh. Meh. A little bit. You can still hear it in my voice, I'm sure, but I'm coughing a little bit less. But when I do, I'm really moving my lung, moving stuff, you know what I'm saying? It's I'm really flaming it up. See, so yeah, I'll be I'll probably be better on Monday. I'll feel I'll feel a little bit under the weather tomorrow still, I'm sure, and then I should be good on Monday. As long as I keep hydrated, folks. Keep hydrated. Alright, you can usually sneak. Starving Marvin. They'll play something like Mecha or something. Or Timmy. Yeah, there you go. It, I think you'd probably still get one hit off. I'll still get one hit off. I would get two off if it was only one of them. But now he did just play two assassins into me, you know? Not the worst thing that could happen. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Kind of trading. This deck is basically built to just get a bar. Basically. It's like, get a bar. That's your goal, get a bar. And a lot of times it doesn't even work for that. <laughs> Re oh, my God. I hate that. Realistically, though, I should probably play... Um, I should play Big Gal in this, because Big Gal's pretty hard to stop from getting at least a couple hits off. Oh, look at him. Now he's just like a, a taunting tank kind of guy. Bing. Bing. I'm just going to use that. No! I mean, I suppose I should have expected that. Damn it. I'm screwed. There's nothing I can do. Do, 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 do. Oh, I didn't hit the Timmy. Thought I could do it. Yeah, that game's a wash. You quit a lot of games with that deck, but... When you win with Thunderbird and Starvin' Marvin, it sure is fun. It sure is fun. Or the Gunslinger Cows, that one's always fun too. It sure is fun. Are any headhunters worth using besides the cows? I mean, you can get value with Dougie. I would say if you're running Dougie, you gotta run Drow probably. But any Dougie can get value if it's played right, but for four energy, it's not usually worth it. Disarray is definitely useful. Um, Mimsy definitely isn't viable. Big Gay Al, like I was saying, like possibly, but like it's just it's just not not good enough to be viable really. You'll see him played in events and you'll see him win some games sometimes, but. That person could have, could have probably won with other stuff, too. Okay. Interesting. Could be like a Mint Berry Crunch or a Man Bear Pig deck. Pope Man Bear Pig kind of thing. Oh, we did get a hit off there. That sucks. Okay, that's interesting. Kind of sets me up for a potential Satan. I like this hit really good. Oh, there you go. Go ahead and hit this. Pop. Oh, geez. Okay, no, we're going to do this. We're going to hit him with this. 
Oh shit. Oh, block it. Nice. We blocked the Incan or the Inuit. Beautiful. Level six Incan down. Satan coming. No. Get it. Oh, I didn't get the shield. Oh, we got the shield now though. I forgot level seven survives if he doesn't take damage. It's brutal. It's brutal. It's a good card to get to level seven is Kyle Dravos. One of the most influential level seven upgrades I've ever seen because he survives level 25 new kid. I mean, look at that. That's brutal. That's like old school call girl shit. Bing, bingo, bango. 36 health he had. He had nothing. Get him, little hint. Get him, little gnome. Oh, he almost had it. Oh, he almost had it. Get some. Get another robot out there, dude. Those robots are killing it. The robots have a thousand health, bro. It's sick. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Oh, shit. Why didn't I get another one? I'm so mad at this guy. Get him. Get him. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. Ba -da -bum 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 -bum. All according to plan. How did he die? I was like, all according to plan. It's cool to see future Randy though. Do I usually broadcast play chaos mode? No, I don't play chaos mode anymore. I played chaos mode like the first few years, but it just doesn't feel really worth the time to me. I hate the meta that it creates usually. It's usually like now it's usually goth kids, scuzzle towers, member berries or something. It's all, it's usually not even like most weeks. The gimmick isn't even usually played. It's pretty stupid. Meat. Is this you meat? Is this meat curtains cousin meat drapes? <laughs> He's got you beat with the 69 though, bro. We need meat curtain 69, not 49. Wait, that emo, is that actually you? Bro, it is one of your accounts? <laughs> That's so funny. Oh shit, perfect. Perfect, bro. Now we get four, four out of the way there. I'm gonna beat you with Thunderbird, bro. It's gonna be embarrassing. <laughs> Dude, watch the Thunderbird. Oh shit, he's gone. Oh shit, he's gone. Why does it keep disappearing like that? There it is. Uh oh, might be the cow. Might be the cow. No, cow, don't do it. Oh no, the cow died. Bah. Nice. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. You played all the cards, I just can't see them. <laughs> was, it, was it lagging on you? 200 errors over and over? I really only like playing all cards or four energy ones. Yeah, that one's pretty good. Um, I don't really, I, it's not that I don't like it necessarily. It just takes so long to do a full run of 12 and like, it's pretty rare I don't get to the full run of 12, but I don't know, it just, I should probably do the free one every month, every week, but. Yeah, shh. We all know that meat curtain, shh. Shh. Keep it on the down low. You've never made it to round 12? Bro, My name I don't Jeff. believe you. Wow! I don't believe you. Fall guys, Jeff? Um, maybe in like four hours, three hours, something like that. Mayhaps. But now we're grinding right now, boys. We grinding. It's darkness. It's darkness. I don't like maybes. Well, I mean, maybe meaning like if you're around then or something. 
I don't like maybes. Well, definitely maybe then. <laughs> you lose around 65 to 69. And you run into the hacker a lot. Yeah, that's probably right around the rank. You'd probably see him a lot. <laughs> then we will play. Yeah, if you come back into chat in three hours and yell at me, we'll play Fall Guys. Absolutely. Well, two, two hours. Say two hours. Two and a half. Two and a half. 9 p.m. 9 p.m. Uh-oh, I'm in trouble. Uh-oh, I'm in trouble. I'm gonna get gizmode. I'm gonna get gizmode. Gizmode down. Oh, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Oh, that was a good play. Kill each other, basically. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Whoop. Safe dumb. All right, good. Safety crash. Usually, whoever sizzles second sizzles superiorly, but not this time, baby. Not this time. We're stealing him real quick. Getting a little quick hit off. I like it. I like it. Oh. Oh, I should have gotten it right at the end. Mecca's down. Mecca's down. All right. Pretty good. Yeah, Jeff, if you're around, we'll play. That's on Angel Wendy. Angel Wendy is one of the best Team Wars cards out there. But not a big place in normal decks for her, mostly just because of... Um, ugh, mostly just because of... Like cards like Inkin and stuff like that, some stuff that just kill her way too fast. Oh, I hate this guy. I'm so sick of this guy already. Come on. Come on. Die. There we go. Thank God. Thank God. Oh shit. Boo. Boo. Get him, Sizzle. Sizzle me timbers. Sizzle me deer. Oh, this could be interesting. If I retarget right here. Oh. Bro. Oh. Oh. What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Oh no, he's gonna get me. He's gonna get me. Hello, Everton. Welcome in, buddy. I think she's paired good with slave. Yeah, slave angel weeks are pretty common. Slave, I wouldn't say, is very playable at a high level either. At your rank, probably pretty good. Boom, boom, boom. Burr, 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 burr. We gotta love keyboard cat. We don't see keyboard cat enough nowadays. We don't see that keyboard cat. There anyone here searching for opponent? Don't want to demonetize your videos. I don't think that demonetizes anymore. I haven't seen that one in a while. It's usually the music nowadays, but it's not. It doesn't really demonetize me. The only thing that truly demonetized me was the sandstorm. That actually made the video un. Or it blocked it in Russia. That's like the worst thing that, that's happened so far. Um, other stuff, it's either it, I, it either shares revenue or um, something like that. Shares it or just takes it or whatever. I don't remember. 
Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, do, do. Oh, wait. <laughs> Figured it out. Figured it out! Oh, shit. You guys are watching the wrong screen. Rip. I used Inuit to kill Mysterion and his cyborg tower at the same time. That's pretty cool. I feel like if I use him, he's just going to get sommed to death, which isn't great. Um, but maybe he'll kill the Mysterion. That could be good. Nathan. Is he going to kill the Mysterion? Oh, he will because of that knockback? Oh, he will because of the... Oh, he doesn't kill him? Oh, no way. No way. That's brutal. Boop. Yeah, that works out pretty well. No, Starvin' Marvin. Oh, this isn't bad. This ain't bad, actually. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, where'd that Mysterion come from, dude? That Mysterion, like, am I stupid? Or that Mysterion, like, spawned right to here. <laughs> that was the weirdest thing ever. All right, we can get a cow stampede, though. Boo! Call girl's too strong. All right, can we get 190-some damage? What I want is the cyborg Kenny on his tower. Ah, oh, those damn hamsters screwed me. No. 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 Oh, that wasn't terrible. Let's go, let's go. I want cyborg tower. There we go. Oh, this won't work. This won't work. Uh. Oh. Get him, Marvin. Get him, Marvin. Nice. We got one. That's the goal. That's the goal of that deck. <laughs> no, I must have just clicked play on that one. Didn't realize it. It happens, brother. I think the same glitch happened to um, meat curtains earlier. Go with Christ, bro. He's still on the teams? Wow. That's a name I haven't heard in a long time. What is he? What is? What does Obi Wan say? We got the one bar though to finish the packs. That's all we needed. Beautiful. Nice. One Nomi getting some work done. We're just gonna play the hanky, see what happens. Hanky panky. Pop. Goes the weasel. If I get two hit. Ooh! Oh! Level six hanky hits way harder than people think. Yikes. Yikes. Ugh. That played, I played that poorly. I played that really poorly. That damn mosquito stayed alive for so long. It's all right, they will Satan him. Even it up. We get the hamsters down. And we get him. Alright, we got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. Don't remove it. Oh, thank God. If he would have removed it, it would have been game over. Alright, now normally you can kill a Sam before he gets his ability off. We'll see if this works. We'll see how it works. Whoop. Oh, I almost blew it. I almost blew it. The gnomes almost took less damage than the Sizzler was doing. Go Sizzler. Sizzler with the Rizzler. Whoa. What we call it that we call it my sizzle rizzle. My sizzle riz. 
Sizzle me timbers. Ooh, scissor me. <laughs> scissor me, Xerxes. I was ready with the I was ready with the Satan block. I was ready with the Satan block with the sun block. The son of God block. The sh shield of the spirit. <laughs> All right. That does it. On this one, we'll watch this ad. Get that legend. You know it. We got Pope. Our Pope is already level six. Ooh, two more though. Let's go. Pope level seven. Here we come. Appreciate y'all being here. If you're watching on YouTube, make sure you like the video. Helps get it out to more people. Tap, tap, tap. I wonder if you just tap your screen, does it like it like on TikTok? No. Maybe someday. Maybe someday it'll be that fancy. Only Harley riders watch on YouTube. Hey now. Hey now. This is what dreams are made of. All right, the adventure lock is done. We'll be moving into Moody. Moody, Moody, Moody. Mad Eye Moody. I might have to derank just to make make matchmaking take less time. It's lonely up here at the top. It's a long way to the top if you wanna suck my bone. Why is the sound on? Where are all the drugs going? Where are all the drugs going? <laughs> uh, funny. Only Harley riders watch on YouTube. That's so weird. Yeah. He's a Harley rider. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, level five, bro. See, this is what I'm talking about up here. Level five Sparky is wild. It means I'm definitely going to get Mintberry Crunch. I mean, ink it. Oh! No! Been so cool that would have been so cool damn 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 that would have been cool I think it turned out okay for me overall but would have been real nice if it would have gotten that off he just spawned a little faster than I thought he would little little bastard right, what do we do here we're we going for a big time, big time. Oh, we got the Randy. No robots for you, Randy. No robots for you. Let's see what we can do. Just take them out. Take them out swiftly. Oh, I didn't think he was going to get that off. Oh, why didn't they? Uh oh. Well, well, that's game over. Jesus Christ. GG. Superheroes are just dumb, dude. Comment in chat if you hate superheroes. If superhero is your number one most hated 
theme to go against as I jump into a superhero deck. Actually, no, I want to play Gizmo. Um, if superhero is your number one hated theme, then like the video, leave a comment, and subscribe. And if you don't do that, then it's not your hated theme. Goth kids are your hated theme? That's not a theme. Doesn't count. Doesn't count. You can hate neutral. That's viable, though, because Satan's in neutral, so, like, there's a lot to hate in there. There's a lot to hate. Oh, I love that. I love that. Guys, look where we are. We're in the promised land, where Shelly's a possible card. I'm in the promised land. I'm in the promised land. I was gonna... Oh, he killed two of the gnomes. That's not fair. Um, I was gonna play him right there, but I was like, no, you know what? He probably has shit he probably has that one thing that i can't remember right now i got you bitch you ain't going nowhere ah oh, i'm the worst what is this deck dude sally that's wild pow pow i think gizmo can one shot him but can he one shot me is the question he might have. Robin's too good. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. Robin is daddy. <laughs> All right, we got Mayor to stop the Psalm, possibly. Ooh, look at your angel Wendy showing up, bro. Pop goes the weasel all around the mulberry bush. The monkey chased the weasel. Oh, Aerostorm. Oh, I got a gizmo. Oh, one of the gizmos survived. That was sick. Man, my gizmos just got aero stormed. That doesn't happen very often. You don't see that one every day. This guy's gonna beat me with Angel Wendy after I just talked trash about her, dude. I just talked mad trash about Angel Wendy and this guy's about to beat me with her. <laughs> this guy's about to beat me with it. Why am I not hurting them at all? What was that? <laughs> he must have left. He must have bailed on his Ned and Jimbo. Never leave a man behind. Those two are vets, bro. They wouldn't have left him. They wouldn't have left men behind. How dare you? How dare you? Play them and then bail on them like that. Best Cartman card? Gotta be Coon, right? Probably Coon, just because he pairs with the call girl. I don't like it when virgins judge me for watching YouTube. Jeez. Twitch is calling YouTube Harley Riders. YouTube's calling Twitch virgins. <laughs> it's hilarious. That's so funny. Oh. That would be in a South Park episode, probably. Every time I cough, it's like all phlegmy. would I have to be passed out before you guys would try to like call my girlfriend or something meat curtains is like that's a really that's a real Harley Rider thing to say <laughs> I 
But yeah, Cartman, probably Coon, then Grand Wizard's probably up there, but the six cost makes him not super viable. Um, Zen is probably up there. Cupid's probably at the bottom. Sheriff. Well, Sheriff is definitely at the bottom. Then Cupid is probably up there. I'm missing one. Osimo. Osimo is probably slightly above Sheriff. Ooh, I'm glad I got that Robin tweak. Got that tweakers. Tweak me, daddy. Uh. Uh. Beep. Got him. Stay alive, Shield Maiden. You got a deceptive amount of health. Oh, the robot! The robot! Shield Maiden! Shield Maiden! More robots! More robots! Oh. oh, I'm hating this. I'm hating this. Or am I loving it? Oh, no! No, we're gonna get him. It's big hits. Oh, he doesn't have the time! He doesn't have the time! Whoop! Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Why would you be sitting there waiting on six energy, dude? That's so wild to me. I gotta get the scene. I gotta get the scene. It's the only way I can do it. It's the only way I can do it. Boo! Boo! Schmackers. Come on, little gnomes. You can get four hundo, can't you? Two gnomes can get four hundo. Two gnomes can get four hundo. Oh, not quite. Not quite. Ooh, new follow. Meat curtains. What? Oh, meat curtains five. It's <laughs> pretty funny. Oh, he got the gnomes. Go right for new kid. Oh, I thought he was going to go for new kid. Real talk. Real talk! Yeah! Get that, get that bitch. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. GG, bro. GG, bro. Paul, though. Like those Harley riders, buttholes get pulverized. That's what his name's from, I bet. Ooh, right in the b-hole. What do we got? What account is this? Moody? Isn't enforcers? What are we? What are we getting on Moody again? I don't remember. Drow, sure. Drow will help with the. Oh no! I was gonna give him robins. Drow will help with the. Um, Gizmo deck? Drow surviving new kid? They might want to run to the bathroom and re-wipe re quick. It is so true though, sometimes you just feeling like you're having a bad day and then you just wipe your butt and you're like oh shit i just had a i just had a crusty ass i was i just had a bad i was in a bad mood because i had a crusty asshole <laughs> no just me okay oh geez you're not gonna tell me you're not gonna tell me you're not gonna tell me that's that terrence mephisto is a good play no damn it well, I probably just lost by using the <laughs> using the the freeze ray to try to get him to I thought I could get him on a new kid, but they sneaked. They sneaked by me. A new kid not helping. Really hurts. How? Alright, well, that's scary. That's scary. Hopefully we can win just because he's got a shitty deck, right? 
Ha. Oh yeah, help me out here, bro. <laughs> oh, you dummy. You idiot. You idiot. Oh, 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 I almost got the shield off. I almost got the shield off. Yeah. He killed his own guy. Did you see that? He boosted his, he boosted his new kid to just absolutely murder his BHK. Come on, BHK. Come on, BHK. Get their first BHK. Get their first BHK. Shit. Shit. Oh, BHK still alive? Oh, BHK still alive? Oh, BHK is still alive? Oh, don't do it to him. Oh, no way. No way. We're going to lose now. That's so funny. Boop. All right. Let's just do some gizmo magic. Right? Right, right, right. Some gizmology. We get some gizmology for these folks. Oh, I didn't want that to happen. I don't want that to happen. No, he got two hits off in the time. Oh no. Oh, oh no. If only that mattered. <laughs> God, imagine though if Satan wasn't both teams and he just whiffed that. Oh, that would have been so fun. That would have been so fun. Boop, ba -doop, ba -doop. Ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop. All right, we're in, we're in good shape here. We're in good shape here. Oh, no. That Nathan is going to be brutal. Pop goes the weasel all around the mulberry bush. Monkey chases the weasel. Oh, if he pushes me. Oh, oh no. Oh, I thought he was going to push me into the path. I thought the, the, or he was going to push me and I was going to survive, but somehow I took damage again, I guess. And then Stan the Great was just going to get his ability off like three more times. That is why PC Principle just isn't a good card, dude. You're more likely to push someone to safety and then they just get nine more abilities off. That's no fun. That's no fun. Nobody likes that. Nice win. What's up, JC? Meat Curtains is starting cults already. Stan the Great and Drow Kyle, the best friends who wreck all. Dude, they're like the... Probably the best tag team combo of any any card. Being able to... Being able to potentially... Um, being able to potentially... Um, like have them perfectly in sync where it's... Drow shield, and then right when Drow shield is up, you use Stan the Great, and then right when Stan the Great's ability is about to get up, you use Drow. It's pretty much that speed if you if they both have Hanky. Otherwise, you know, you just got to survive a little bit longer. But you can usually do it pretty well. Freeze Ray helps with that. Freeze Ray lets you split the gap if there's time between them, which is very useful. And if it's Shield Maiden, then her shield in between can make it even longer or make it even more viable. All right, who's going to win this? Uh, double sizzle. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I think he's going to get a bar, but I think I'm going to get a bar, too. Oh, no. Let's just freeze him. Oh, that's probably not it. That's probably not it. He might get two here, though. My cows are going crazy. I get, oh, I got a gizmo. Oh, baby. There's another one. Love it. Guess who got the two bars? I did. <laughs> we got the giz and I'm giving it to you. We got the giz and I'm giving it to you. We got the giz and I'm giving it to you. Who's got the giz? I do. I do. What a save. Take him out. Oh, brought him closer. Now they can both get hit by Satan. Let's at least save them. Yeah. Oh, 
Uh, what if that shield did that, dude? That'd be sick. All right, have them survive. Nice. Three hits no matter what. Gnomes are good for that. Ooh. Ah. Oh shit. <laughs> that's gonna be a lot of that's gonna be a lot of roosters, boys. <laughs> that's gonna be a lot of roosters, boys. Love your videos, man. It's my first time on stream. Dude, nice. Ice Lord A. Nice name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome in. Welcome in. Always good to see someone catching a stream. We usually stream on Twitch, but we've been expanding them to be on YouTube at the same time. But if you want to see a better quality stream, you can head over to Twitch. There's also more fun stuff you can do in chat over on Twitch. You can touch my butt over on Twitch. Not true. Not true. But someday. Haptic feedback suits. V virtual reality games, we're going to be able to touch each other from a distance. Bet. You ever see Ready Player One when they do that sex scene? Bet. That's real. That's documented. Biddy, 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 biddy. Bum, biddy, bum, biddy, 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 bum. I'm bored. All right. Moody is completed. That pack is done. So we will quit that one. Imagine the hanky panky going on in the labs that are designing those haptic feedback suits. Too trite. I bet, man. You're like, wait a second. What if we do? How does this feel? What about this? How does that feel? <laughs> like they're putting it around their cock. And they're like, can you feel that? Ah, uh, not really. Not, not, what about that? Oh, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. There you go. <laughs> That's how we do it. Oh, so it's got to be like a like a back and forth motion. Can't be a circular motion. <laughs> I don't know what to do here, guys. We're in trouble. We just fed right into his stupid face. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I can't believe he hasn't used his ability. Come on, get the Mysterio on in one shot. Boom! Love it. Love it. Oh, he got my... He got my bitch. No. He got my bitch. Honestly surprised. Oh, that's probably still further away. No. All right, we're safe, though. We're safe. We're safe. I'm liking this. What's he trying to do here? That's when you decide to use it? That's when you decide to use it? Bro, that's a little odd. You were sitting there with a hankied up mecha, and you used it there, dude? What in the world just happened? <laughs> and then Hakey kills the Marcus. <laughs> I kind of feel bad. <laughs> what the hell was he doing? <laughs> oh my gosh. We're laughing. We're having a good time. You blew it! Absolutely. Unhinged. Unhinged. I don't have to do that. Get him, Nomies! Oh, you can't be serious. Oh, look at that, though. Oh, look at that, though. Look at that, though. Oh, he almost had him. He almost had him. Bing. Pop. Bang pop. I can't believe 
he never used that ability, dude. He there was like at least three times it could have been useful. Like right there, he could use it. Terrible, 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 terrible. Yeah, he had me at such a bad like disadvantage with all my stuff pushing into him, Santa protecting the mecha. He could have like mind controlled and then Santa immediately mind controlled again. Like he could have done some sick stuff. Nope. Nerf call girl. Call girl is definitely good. What I would do to her now, I would probably just say lower her attack damage. Dancing in the twilight. Fun fact, Hanky just beats Mysterion straight up so you don't have to step him at all. Fun fact. Fun fact. It's a little rude. Bit rude. Half attack speed? I mean, you probably can't do both of them. You probably gotta pick one or the other. Let's just do that. Just because. I'm not sure if that's great or not, but. Oh, that's not great. Shit. Not worth playing anything to protect him. That was maybe a mistake on his part. He shouldn't have played anything there. He definitely shouldn't have played the hanky. Well, that'll butter him up for next time. Oh, I thought we almost got him there, dude. That was sick. All right, easy breezy that first time. Oh my God, I can't believe that. I can't believe that. Wow, he just beat me. Cause he'll he's gonna get the Robin before I can kill him. Wow, dude. Okay. He must have turned his cheats on, bro. After we beat him the first time. <laughs> it's a lot of damage. Ugh. No, I needed Hanky to hit the doggo. Oh, thank you, live. God, these doggos never glitch for other people, bro. They never glitch for other people. All right, if anything, that's a draw. So, congrats, bro. You won that time. I should have remembered he had doggo and saved the removal for it. All right, I think we're done. With Moody, yep. Moody can go bye bye. We beat him the first time, that's all that matters. Sparky's top three legend, yeah, for sure. I would say it's probably Shield Maiden, then Sparky, then. Probably Sizzler, honestly. As far as consistency goes. I would say Alchemist would pro probably be up there. It's just we don't have a whole lot of data really to know if he's useful in a more meta sense when he's not being boosted. Because like arguably he's not good. He's not as good if the enemy also has him. So like when you play in an event, everybody's going to have him. So it's like it kind of skews how good he seems. Yeah, I'm not sure. 
happy. It's just too fucking sweaty up here. I hate it. I hate it. That's what I get for just winning over and over and over and over again. All I do is play event stuff and I still get way up here. I didn't use that. I didn't use that. I didn't use that. Bro, I didn't use that. Did it just glitch? Oh, the hanky got pushed. Oh, no way. Dude, that, like, it glitched and it was like, it was as if he had pulled. Get the hit. Okay, good. Um, it was as if he had pulled my shit. I didn't need to do that. Shit, that's a bad card. Well, that will just keep him away from me for a bit. <laughs> that robot might be able to get some hits on the Nathan. Nope. Nope, not enough. I just have to give up Kyle here, maybe? Jeez. That's such trash, dude. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Wow, dude. What a dumb deck. Laugh it up, dude. That's just Cyborg Tower being broken as hell. Fucking loser. All because of that glitchy first part. Suck my cock. Mysterion. Uh, yeah, Mysterion. Uh, yeah, Mysterion. Oh, no. Mintberry Crunch. Shit, I forgot about Mintberry Crunch. I would say it's hard to, like, tier those. They'd probably all be on, like, the same tier. S+. Plus. <laughs> They'd probably be like those five. Mysterion. Call Girl might be up there. Mintberry Crunch. Three of them are in Superhero. How crazy is that? Mecha would probably be up there too. Yeah! Meat Curtains. Yeah! Appreciate you. This fucking dummy. Dude, that guy emoting like he accomplished something with that stupid deck and that dumb glitch that screwed up the beginning so much. Like, my guy mind-controlled him, and that guy didn't die, and all sorts of crazy shit. What is that? What is that? No lava? What just happened? What is going on here? What is going on? Are we getting hacked? Is this Apex? This is wild. This is wild! Do, 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 do. Uh oh, that's not great. That's not ideal. Do. All the attack on him. Oh my god, and look who survived, dude! You cannot be serious! You cannot be serious, dude. Dude, you could not be serious. There's no fucking way that that just legitimately happened, dude. That disarray was glitchy as fuck at the beginning, and then I'm gonna believe that that just happened? No way, dude. No fucking way. That guy was fucking cheating. No fucking way that I believe that that guy got that lucky. That the that one card that he needed to survive survived that. No fucking way. No fucking way. That is absolutely trash. Absolutely trash, dude. I cannot believe that. She's so sweaty up here, dude. Level six mecha. Oh, no way. I blocked that. Get him. Get him, six helmet. Get him, six helmet. 
Oh, I didn't get him. I didn't get him. Oh, no way. Dude, what is this deck? Level six, level six, level six. Jesus fucking Christ. <sighs> fucking losers, dude. I've got one level six. <laughs> two. I got two. I forgot Hanky. I think that's it, though. Hanky and Six Elder Randy. We've got a few that are close. I think Psalm's close and Mecha are close. Nobody in Mystic or Fantasy is anywhere near. Let's see if you'll regret that. Oh, I was hoping it wouldn't get the... Come on! Ugh. Ugh. We gotta kill the midberry crotch! Oh, nice. Nice! Oh, I thought I had it right. Robin slept on me. Interesting. Interesting. Terrible. We could mind control the coon into the call girl potentially. It's good value always. Always good value. Ah, fucking hell. Give me that mintberry crunch, bro. Give me that mintberry crunch, bro. All right, that was pretty safe for a minute. Ice Lord, I mean, if you play at the top level, I know how many peop how many runs people lose every week. These top players with those levels are still losing every week. They're still losing every week to people with lower levels. So, I, I don't I don't know what his video video says, but you can definitely win or lose with just normal competitive levels. Now you need those levels. And not everybody has those levels, sure. I would say they should like they should have set it up to like periodically reset. Cuz there's just too many teams in gold right now, so that is definitely an issue, but like if you play late Saturday night, you get a lot of good matchups because a lot of other people like mostly only the good people are left at that point because a lot of other people get it over with earlier. And people that are playing on Sunday night have potentially practiced all weekend, right? So you're going to, even if they're not the greatest levels, they're probably going to be pretty knowledgeable in the deck at least. Every deck at these ranks is the exact same. Yeah, right? You notice patterns after watching me play for a while, don't you? It sucks. That's why I don't stay high up here very often, because it's just boring. And, and like, and as far as your levels on Team Wars, it doesn't take, it, it just takes a team of 50, even if they're all at level, level 7,000, it's enough, it's enough caps to get your deck leveled enough to be competitive against anybody. So like, will you potentially lose matches just because they have better levels than you? Just slightly better levels than you? Sure. Yeah. But that's the incentive to level up your deck and stuff, right? 
that's that's kind of got to be there. And it, and it's a really like Team Wars is th literally if if South Park didn't have Team Wars the way they set it up, this game would have died a long long time ago. But they just had they just created the perfect mix of like needing to be high-ish ranked for the caps, needing to play three times a week for the caps, and having the you know the weekend games. Like they've just they created a a gameplay loop that is just very like very good. You know what I mean? Like it's not too taxing. If I want to keep playing this game, like there's other games where if I wanted to keep playing them, I would have had to have played three hours every Saturday to be able to finish the event or whatever. But now I don't have to do that anymore. Like you don't have to do all these things. You don't have to finish the events. You don't have to grind challenge mode. You don't have to, you know, you don't have to finish challenge mode every week in order to get an extra match in Team Wars or something like other other games might have some crazy stuff like that, you know? Oh, we got Infiltrator, Infiltrator Kevin having a little fun with that. We'll see how this goes. Worked out pretty well. That worked out pretty well. We're gonna have to freeze him. Get some extra damage here. No! No! We got a ton of gizmos, but it's not gonna matter. Uh. Uh. But we're gonna blow up this this sizzler though. <laughs> Boom! That's just always fun. Dude, we cycled all the way back to our freeze ray though. If we could have gotten that off, that would have been sick. My sizzler has no stacks, dude. Get the stacks. Oh, yes. Get the bar. Get the bar. <laughs> Too good. All right, do we just salvage it? I don't think so. I really don't think so. Oh, did I still get the hit off? Yeah. Well, he probably just beat me. But if new kid hits, all right, we're good. Unless he gets the gizmos. Unless he gets the, no, he didn't get it. Didn't get it. He would have had to time that better. All right, we might be in good shape. Can't the game find you a decent opponent? I mean, any way that they could try to do that, it would be, one, it would be really difficult to find a match because... For people like me, there's not going to be any, there's just typically not going to be anybody. Like if they try to do it by deck rank or something like that, there's not going to be very many people that can match up against me. So that's that, that would just be a bad experience on that end, right? Same for people that are too low too, right? If somebody's brand new, there's not going to be a whole lot of people that are similar to them. Um, I would say, damn it, that's so annoying. I would say... You could do it by rank, but you can just derank then, and that defeats that. That's how they started. Like, the original implementation of Team Wars had rank mattering, and everybody figured that out, and they just deranked for easy matches. So you can't do that. Um, I would say, I think it does already kind of try to match you with a team that has, like, potentially higher caps, but, like, once you wait two seconds, you're going to be out of that queue, you know what I mean? Like, it's going to be gonna be set up and oh Jesus he's gonna be able to just Marcus me to death that's so funny no look at this though 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 don't do it to him, Kevin! Don't do it to him, Kevin! Don't do it to him, Kevin! <laughs> we beat that guy twice. Oh no, all he needed to do was get his Marcus out. And while I'm talking and not paying any attention. Um, but yeah, it, it would just it would be difficult to do it in a way that wouldn't be able to be like gamed and cheated. Um, then you have teams like Chefs that would exploit it by Figuring out how it works and then matching up against themselves on other teams or something like that. Boom. Silvermine 311. Nice. That's an old account. But yeah, without the Team Wars setup they have, I would say if they would have made like a Platinum League that is just like the top. 50 teams and it's just like that's it like it doesn't matter how many crowns you get it's the top 50 teams crowns and then everybody else is in gold 
50 teams, 50 players, 250 times three. That's a lot of runs. You're probably not gonna run out of, you're probably not gonna run out of runs. The issue would be like if you segment it too much as the game does start to die or whatever, you will see it almost impossible to match up and get a, um, to match up and get a, oh Jesus, and get a match or to match up, not match up and just to match up. To get a match in general will be difficult, which is not great. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, the mind controls. God, I hate mind control decks, dude. Whatever. Congratulations, you're playing mind control towers. You haven't been touched by a woman in years. Don't they base matchmaking off PvP wins? No. Matchmaking is your rank, solely your rank. No, literally nothing else. They don't care about your, your deck value. They don't care about your... Um, your PvP wins, they don't care about um, what new kid level you are, they don't care about any of that. It is absolutely just your rank. Plus or minus 200 probably to start and then every 10-20 seconds it'll increase that value by more probably. Up to a certain length. You can't match somebody that's like 4,000 trophies below you. But you could match. I've matched 500 before. Any more than that's pretty rare, just because there's a lot of people playing. Once, you know, once people stop playing, like actually stop playing, there there really hasn't been a noticeable. Not since I've ever started playing the game, there's never been a noticeable drop in like the total amount of people playing, and like how many, like how long it takes to get matches and stuff like that. Like it's almost never been an issue, which is pretty wild to think about. Oh, how does he get that out, like, mid-freeze? Bring him down, Kevin! Bring him down! Dude, Kevin's a beast! Kevin's a beast! Oh, no, Kevin's down! Kevin's down! No, I don't like that. And while Ned was hitting the call girl, or the Wendy, the whole time... <laughs> it's the first time I've ever used that at the right time. Because I always call Wendy Call Girl. Yeah, and there's so many teams. Yeah. Why did the developer stop supporting the game? I don't know. Could have been a contract thing. Could have been a licensing thing. Maybe they just they won't let them edit it anymore. I'm not sure. could be just like the they didn't have my guess is the original people that worked on the game are no longer there right so the only people that could have worked on it didn't have a huge grasp of the game itself and as a result made it really time consuming costly to fix anything to change anything and so they just made the decision that they're just gonna let it ride I mean, I expected this a long time ago, to be honest, so. Oh, no way he got that off. No way. Yeah. Well, I mean, at this, at this point, there's probably more level 25 players than there's any other player. Just because of the way the... Like the fact that if you're playing the game at this point, you've probably been playing it for a very long time. Just in general. Oh no, that's what I needed it for. But we could maybe pull it off with some sneaky hamsters. No, nah, it's game over. GG. The Kevin deck is fun though. But yeah, even like we started a, a bronze team, and it's like, there's still like six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve bronze teams that have 50 people in the team. There's teams that don't have a Discord, don't have, you know, you don't, you don't know, like I don't know what their 
team name is. I don't know anyone in their team. Nobody does, but like there are 45 people strong that have been playing the game since day one that have always only ever managed the team within game chat. It's just, it's wild, man. Now, a lot of those teams die and, you know, get moved on to some other team and blah, blah, blah. What's up, Blue? Apex just found out about this game a year ago and is now watching streams, you know? Like, that's wild, you know? After the time when they stopped supporting the stream, he found it and is now watching streams for the game, right? Like, that's that the game has just crazy longevity. The game has crazy sticking power. Like, how many games have I played that have... How many games have I played that have, like, stopped being games in the time that South Park has been made, created, come on, get them once, uh, made, created, and, you know, still going. There's been, like, World War Doe is between it. World War Doe is a game. Um, uh, Heroic Magic Duel was a game. What else was? What else has been canceled? Um, there was one called Castle Crash that I played that's now canceled. Um... Hero Bump is in the same state that this one's in, where it's just same shit over and over again. So kind of the same treatment. Uh, what else is there? There's been a couple more that have crashed. Crashed and burned. I think I need to just snipe this one. Oh, I was like, I think he might have gotten it. Not a, big, not a big deal, though. <laughs> Yeah, blue my hair. I haven't cut my hair in like almost two years. Year and a half, not that long ago. Oh my god, I hate this. Yeah, for sure. If you have the right cards, lower level cards can do pretty well against higher level stuff for sure. There's some stuff where a level like doesn't impact you as much. Like DSR, you can get away with him at like her at like level three compared to this other stuff. I got a golden ticket. I got a golden ticket. All right, here's the plan. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Do I have to transmog him? Get him! Alright, that's not bad. Hey, that's not bad. Hey, that's not bad. I'm gonna get mayored. Shit! Get it off! Oh, that would've been nice. That would've been nice. Oh, if I would've gotten that off, that Marcus would've been alive for a year. Come on, baby. Come on, baby, won't you give me a sign? Oh, I needed that ability. I needed that ability. Shitty. No! No! Go balls deep, baby. 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 Come on, Hanky, you could do it. Survive it. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. You could do oh. No. I hate draws so much. <laughs> Game's interesting. Like it's our favorite character is just battling. People love South Park. Well, I think Bruh. the biggest thing is that it's the only one. Like you know how there's like a bunch of different Star Wars games. Like if I look if I look up Star Wars Mobile, I'm going to get Star Wars Galactic Defense, Star Wars Battlefield Epic Duel. I'm going to get all sorts of games. If I look up South Park mobile game, I get this. 
And I think that's a big part of what's driven its consistent, consistent growth, even though it's not updated, is because South Park is still around, right? South Park hasn't gone anywhere, so people still think South Park. Yeah, draws in chaos mode. That's another reason I don't play chaos mode. I can't stand the six minute draws. Can't stand it. Seems usually good though. We have a dozen or so really active people. Yeah, I mean, even just a small group can make it fun for sure. So many come in and play and think if they build the perfect deck and they'll start winning other games. Then FG. Well, yeah, that's the thing. Like playing it now would be really difficult because you're gonna just come against people who. That's what she said. Oh, what the fuck? I'm. We're just gonna. They're gonna come against. Come against people that um are just very. Are just are. Oops. Are very set up already. Like their their decks are already stacked. They're gonna have level six rares all across. Level seven commons all the way across. Even at lower level. Even if you're at a lower rank, it's not difficult to get a level seven rare or, or a level six rare or a level seven common. It's just, it's like months of time, that's it. Months of requests, that's it. And if you're on a good team, you're always gonna get those requests filled. So it's just a question of time. And when the game's been here for six years, a couple months isn't a big deal. A couple months isn't a big deal. In fact, it's like, it goes so fast, you know, when you're playing for six years, you're like, oh, you know, in three months, I'll have a level seven rare. Awesome. But yeah, so it doesn't, it's not hard to get a couple cards leveled up pretty well. And there's enough good common and rare cards that like you can build a deck. Like when I first started my adventure lock account, I did nothing but request buck in your baby. And I got my buck in your baby to level five way soon way sooner than I should have versus like who I was playing. And she would one shot like so many units and she would get stacked so fast. And to this day, the highest stacked Buccaneer Bebe that I've ever seen and ever gotten was a level five Buccaneer Bebe on my noob account at like level 11 or something because somebody fed an entire two chicken coops to her and then would like play an assassin right next to her thinking it would kill her and she would one shot it and take no damage. Like it was the funniest thing ever. And okay, that this account's done. And, but like, so, but if you were starting when the game started, like for me, when I was level 19 new kid, there were like 15 other 19 new kids that existed. Like everybody else was level 18 for a long time, right? And when that group hits 20, then the next group hits 19, right? So there's just like, there were like tiers of it. And then, you know, I was at a disadvantage because my rats were only level five. And then I got my rats to level six and it helped a lot because everybody else had rats level six. You know, so it was, it was just kind of, you know, nobody really had epic cards leveled up. Nobody really had legends definitely not leveled up. And back then it took a lot longer to get them good. So like, a legend wasn't really playable until level four back then, and nobody got it there. Oh, look at that. Level seven dark mage. You see that? Do you see that? All right. Well, we have 21 points after playing for an hour and a half. So that's not great. <laughs> so I don't think we're going to finish the event, but we're playing. We're just having fun. You can sometimes come out ahead, get ahead against level five legendary uh, decks. Uh, no. Yeah, yeah, exactly. If you have the right cards and you use them well, like Mackie level seven can deal with a bunch of stuff defending it. <laughs> what do you, what do you kid, mean? Right? <laughs> Who's gonna know I glance doesn't play chaos mode? Oh, I don't, I, I just don't play it mostly because one, it just takes so long to play it. Two, the draws are like six minutes long and that just infuriates me. And three, like half the time, the gimmick isn't even played. So it's like, oh, like girl cards are stronger and it's still towers and goth kids are the is the best deck to play. Like that's not fun. So I just typically don't play that. And also on my main account, I have exactly 69 challenge modes completed. So I like to keep that streak intact as well. So if I do play it, I play it on the other accounts, but I just, I just never have really enjoyed it. Other people made content like specifically around that sometimes. So I just like 
didn't even it's like all right well we got three other people who are playing challenge mode all day wednesday and thursday because they don't have fucking jobs so i'm just i'm not even gonna bother playing challenge mode and also i hate the i hate the friendly fight levels i hate it i don't i don't like it all right blue bucket head coming at you yeah, I have exactly 69, I'll show you. I'll, let me show you. Team War doesn't have a good team is the best part. Yeah, there's so many people who play the game just because everybody, like everybody else is still playing it. I'm sure there's a lot of people that would quit if, if five other people quit, they would quit too, you know? If your whole team quit, they would quit. But yeah, if you go to Staterinos and you look up challenges complete, right there, 69. <laughs> Suck it. Suck it. Yeah, and Team Wars, I have some of the most... I have some of the, probably the most total Team Wars runs of anybody in the game, except for some people on my team that I know play just as many accounts as I do. But I've played five accounts for a very long time. That's at least 15 matches every weekend, right? So that's like, that's a lot of experience for Team Wars, you know? That's impressive to win it all. Yeah, I mean, like I said, not trying to like toot my horn or anything, but like, Almost every single time that I played challenge mode, I got to 12 wins. Like, almost every single time. I would give up, like, one win, usually, like, one run usually would be given up because I just needed to, like, figure out what the meta was. And then I changed to that deck, and then I didn't, didn't lose. Oh, I hate that. I hate that. But it's also boring. Because, like, the games are kind of slow, or the the games are potentially really easy, too. Because sometimes you're going to match up against someone who's just terrible because they don't have any... In, in challenge mode, it's just like you're going to rank up against somebody who else is who's playing. There's no... There's no... You could match up with somebody who's ranked 2,000. There's no, like, matchmaking at all in Team Wars, or in challenge mode. So a lot of times you're going to win just because the other guy is so bad compared to you. And that's not fun to me. That's just like grinding out 12 games versus shitters. Like, that's not fun. And then, like, two of them get good. Or, like, two matches are good throughout the whole thing. And all it takes is one draw that takes six minutes for me to just be mad. So that's mostly why. Did that... Bro, did that cow, or did that rat get one? Did that rat get damage off at one, at that level? You know what I'm saying? I can't speak right now. Oh, that damn, that damn scout. Do I, who do I save here? Whoa. Oh, I healed him after the hit. Nice. He was already fully stacked too, so that's going to absolutely break him. And if he plays anything, the robot gets the hit. So he can't play anything. The chaos bars count towards battle pass. That's true. That's true. There's a lot of time. When, when, you when, when your rank mattered more, it doesn't matter as much anymore, but when they changed how caps worked, um, being like 8,000 to 8,500 mattered a lot more. So you would get to 8,500 on Tuesday or 8,000 on Tuesday and then just play chaos mode on Wednesday and Thursday to get your caps at 8,000 or 8,500. So it wouldn't matter if you won or lost. You just get your caps because you couldn't lose. You couldn't lose um, lose rank, right? Because the worst thing is like you're sitting at 8,500 exactly. You have to get a bar. You lose the first match. Or really, you lose the second match would be the worst. And then you're underneath the, underneath the threshold. Come on, baby. Come on, you could do it. Come on, baby. It's funny. His name's Don't Be a Bitch. And then he left halfway through the game. <laughs> Not that I don't do that, but I mean, it's kind of funny. Yeah, Jason, that's cool to hear that there's other, you know, small teams coming up. 
and if it's if it's fun, it's fun, man. You know, if you're playing with 12 people in Bronze League and you're having a fun time, that's good. The game that the game's great then. Like a lot of times, these games are only fun in the end game. You know, they're not any fun early on. Like you, like most people will will say fuck the grind and they'll buy an account that's already stacked up because. But in this game, the grind is part of the fun because like early on, you know, people aren't gonna have certain cards. You don't get cards available, so you, you're slowly learning the cards. It really exposes you to them pretty well. Where in other games, like. I have 67 cards, like Warcraft Rumble, the first day that I played that game, I had all like 67 cards. And then you like upgrade them and they become legendary and stuff like that. But it's like, I had all of them in like one day and it's like, that's overwhelming to learn all of these different cards and all of the different things they work. And then on top of that, each card had like three different things that it could have been, like three different perks basically. So it's like Mecha Timmy having a perk that's like, a longer ability or his attacks every time he attacks